Hey folks, this is Bardic Dragoon. Welcome back to the backlog. Sorry about missing the last two days. Uh, that actually Tuesday just felt like shit, but Thursday I was just lazy. <laughs> I figured I already missed Tuesday, so why not? But nonetheless, it is Saturday evening, and that means more Saga Scarlet Grace. Apparently, actually, this whole collecting the red shards thing, I'm a pretty solid way through that. I've also been rethinking a certain degree kind of how I've been approaching things. Yeah, let's go here. I don't think we've been here yet. <laughs> Is there a Scarlet Shard in Bins? Or Bissianoro as well? Probably. Only probably? You're, we're so, and we're so far away from Azukan too. Alright. Down there. That place is an ace, uh, or bad bad. Ace upgrades. They work. That work with water. Which is a thing that exists. And, oh heck, it's over here. <laughs> they work with. Or with earth, plant, I forget what it's called. They work with plant as well. Southeast boundary, interesting, but there seems to be a shard here, so I guess we should look around. Ooh. A ring of fending, okay. Fending off enemies or something? What? Ooh. Security with me, what do we got? Let's see, what can we do? We're looking for someone willing to work the bodyguard for, shall we say, a certain individual. Yes, there's a war warden it for you. Give us your baddest dude. Is he saving the president? Okay, let's see. Am I giving us literally a hint of what do we need? Um... out of being off and about. I heard a rumor that if you find a red that if you find a red stone deep in the forest, you'll be turned to stone. If everyone who finds a stone gets turned into stone, who managed to tell the story in the first place? And thus is the nature of rumors, my lady. Now let us go deeper into the forest. Alright, well that seems like a good plot lead if I've ever heard one. <laughs> I'm kinda of curious to see what else is going on in these other towns here. Vacant Forest Glade. Gather round, friend, and I shall spin a ta or spin an ancient tale passed from lip to ear throughout the world entire. I hear tale of a cryptid that looks like a snake, but isn't. It looks like a lizard, but has no legs, and it cries and jumps so that none might confuse it for either creature. I hear tale of a cryptid with huge feet and coarse black hair. It looks like a dirty man, but it is not. It looks like a wolf, but it is not, and it wanders the forest and mountains. I hear a tale of a cryptid that can be killed, yet will come back to life seven times. Is this a story true? Is it but legend? Not alive can say. Why are people so easily swayed by such rubbish? <laughs> no any stupid gossip? Alright. Ah, product development! Ha 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 ha! Industry here? Ha, <laughs> keep dreaming. We're all tavern. We all we got are taverns and drunkards. Sounds like my kind of place. Except not. Oh, hello. What are you? Let's see, we can use some mead. There's some mead to make. Labor. A diligent worker can be hired to assist in a variety of roles across all industries. From the northern mines up in Normia to the forest round. Makulikali in Hibernia. There ain't no place in this world that don't need workers. Alright, here's a little something for you. Ash. Yay. Hey you, how about a drink, eh? Just one drink? I cannot abide abide alcohol. If all were drunk, none would be able to handle the fields. Or the fiends. Oh well, aren't we just fancy britches around here? Around here, we drink this stuff as if it were water, you know? 
How about I take some water? Ale's safer and cheaper than water. Are you sure you want water? Yes, please. What a pain. Or I mean, that's fine, friend. Let me boil it here for a bit. <laughs> ah, okay. And so we can do different amounts of labor depending on what resource we spend there. Okay. Nifty. We have laborers. Let's... The problem is I don't have much mead. Okay, wait. No, that's, that's a special goods. This thing, if we look in these, can it tell us where to get more stuff? I forgot where we got the mead from. Provincia Justinia. Okay, cool. So you know what? Produce ten sets of laborers. <laughs> really bustling around here lately, huh? I suppose you've taken... You're the one to thank for this, then. Cornucopia stew. That sounds interesting. Seasoned with the bounties of both mountain and sea, this meat stew is simmered for seven days to ensure maximum flavor. All right, cool. All right. Oh, we didn't need that. Talk. What's the haps? Ooh, I wonder if there's any interesting gossip. I feel like we did the last thing we were supposed to do first by accident. That's fine. We'll, we'll do that then. We'll save the game because I feel like there's probably going to be some kind of fight because apparently we found another one of those red shards. And be careful. If the rumors are true, there's also a chance you could be turned to stone. Will I really be turned to stone? I don't believe it. I mean, the other shards haven't. I mean, I suppose whatever has it could have that potential, but we're fine. It's fine. It's merely a rumor. What? Let's so try this again. Oh, I hear there's a man using a redstone to summon fiends near Anciano. Was it truly a redstone? Regardless, we cannot ignore someone who is summoning fiends. I find myself most in uneasy about this. I am compelled to go. Okay, so we'll try this, but depending on what happens here. And it's something we have come across, that could be true, I believe it. Fiends, come for the redstone in Anciano, everyone run, run! Well, I suppose one could consider that using a redstone to summon fiends. As with all rumors, the more, there is a most like a kernel of truth at the center of misplaced details. Is the red stone that the fiends are after really an Anciano, or is it that you that has it? Actually, you have it now. Fight! He gave me the Scarlet Shard! The fiends come, destroy it at once! Let it begin. And we got a bunch of crystals. Cool. Well, that was very quick that that occurred. All right. Let's go this way. Southeast boundary. Well, we didn't get a thing saying those two wondering if there's a crystal here, so I'm guessing probably not, but hey, let's wander around. An area largely consisting of dense woods located in the jungle covered region that is the southeast boundary. There's a bunch of the random jungle. A, her a hermit stands in the bluff between two waterfalls. I don't know that be interesting. An absolutely massive bird's nest built from a, sta or from a stack of tree trunks. Hmm. It's more like be a Garuda nest rather than a. Then again, Phoenix is going to be pretty big. A hole at the base of a mountain. Because its entrance is covered by trees, it is difficult to distinguish from a cave. 
All right, well, let's start with the town here. See what's going on. At least I presume. It said to belong to Birdmen. You okay, buddy? It didn't look good. A glider that crashed after or crash land after parting from Birdman Village. Are you injured? Shall I summon a medic? A medic? Oh, you mean this? <laughs> I'm fine, but thank you. Merely a scratch. Pray tell, what is this contraption precisely? It appears to almost be a pair of bird wings. You're not far wrong. This is a glider. Soaring the open skies with this is my dearest wish. Or it's my dearest wish. Indeed, surely Celestials would take exception to humans attempting flight. I rather doubt they'd mind. My problem isn't Celestials. I just need to gather more feathers. I cobbled these wings together from moa feathers, which are quite difficult to come by. If you were to ever catch one, do you think you might be willing to share its feathers with me? If you need feathers, why not make use of the myriad of feathers scattered about here? Why do you specifically seek moa feathers? Moa feathers are really ideal for this. When you apply the proper treatment, they become both strong and flexible. I mean, cockroach feathers would also do the trick, but hunting for fiends would be a lot more dangerous than trying to catch a moa. Anyway, it's been nice chatting with you, but I need to get back to work. Lots of repairs and improvements needed for my next, or before my next attempt. Is that a moa? Oh, look, a moa. Oh, wait, don't run. Lesson Grove. Oh, fiddlesticks, it was over there. So then what happens here? Oh, this bird is caught in a trap. Let's set it free. It doesn't look like it's worth much eating. Or maybe not, I don't know, like, RPG world map scale. Who knows how big things actually are. <laughs> Please hold still for a moment, I'll set you free. Hmm. there, but the bird just... The little bird flew into the depths of this forest. Let's see what happens. And I flew to another one. Secret Flower Garden. The forest has... Per oh. The forest has parted, revealing a path to its innermost depths. At the path end, a, pl or a plaza boasts a tremendous variety of flowers in full bloom. Interesting. Oh, what the? You've done well to find your way here. Tell me, what is your desire? What? Uh, nothing? I wasn't looking to get anything. I just kind of fallen a bird around. What happened? Okay. Yeah. You know, we've been at this for 15 minutes, we haven't fought anything yet, so... I don't know what happens if I say treasure. Then you must prove your worth. I'm gonna end up fighting her anyway. Alright. Wards. So we got three different ty enemy types, don't know what any of them are. A lot of Natura crystals. Let's see. Bullet conditional with a ranged attack. Exploit a foe's weakness to deal critical damage three times. And stun and paralyze to put a foe to sleep to stop it from that. Alright, cool. Feels like I am 
under-leveled somehow, and I don't know if I'm missing something or something else going on with this. I'm gonna put enemies to sleep. Of course, calling the condition didn't do anything but get us to the, towards that reward, so... See, this battle, that didn't have to do that much damage. Okay. Let's see. Okay, now she's getting ready for something. That's literally the only thing that's happening this turn. Alright, cool. I'll have him smash. So I don't want to attack the bird lady, and she's probably going to be the major focus. Then again, with the number of flying things, exploiting enemy weakness is probably not going to be hard. Mm. And these two... You just take a quick shot. You. See, maybe we learn anything, or maybe we get a unite attack to go off. You know. Can't be put to sleep. Yes, okay, he's focused now on Night Boy there. And those two are bound. Can I get lucky? No, okay. And she's attacking, and he is her target. Have yeah, him put up a counter. <sighs> Let's see. Paralysis and a lot of and a lot of damage. That's not good. Oh my! Nice. That was a lot of damage. <laughs> ah, cause it blocks. All right. Let's see. Oh, we don't want that going off again. In case you're like guarding or something like that. Um, that'll put her off just that way. So, yeah. There we go. Darn, been stunned. Lady Moth. Oh, she's a moth. I thought she was a bird. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Actually, honestly, this thing seems to be the real damage dealer, the plants. Or flower elementals, I guess. I didn't know flower was an element, but okay. Or he could actually get his stun to work on it. Go figure. I really didn't do much damage to anything. So like, that's, that's not great. Okay, what do we got going on? Heal slash. That's... Uh, what was it? Succubus we were fighting last time? That, that hit that, and that was kind of not great. Okay. So let's... Stun it late again, because we don't know what you're doing. So we'll just keep you from doing it, whatever it is. My understanding that mostly is restore or recovering status effects, not healing. 
anything with that one. Both be the same amount of time. We only really have two characters we need to worry too much about. Everybody else doing something. Mm, heal slash at the sound is probably going to be slashing, maybe? I mean, the feather storm, the feather shot somebody could be, so yeah, we'll go for that. Boost her speed, I guess. I cannot allow this. Ah! Called it. Oh no, oh fuck. That wasn't good. That's not great either. Alright, but this might be a good turn around and come back. Cool. My apologies. Alright. So since what's her name's dead, what are you about to do exactly? Uh no, stampede. be able to take out one of the birds, but not before it attacks us. I have an earth, actually. That can stun me. I forgot about that. Yeah. Or... Mm. I have an earth, but for the chance to stun Red Stampede from going off, hopefully. Offense and defense are one. No, I should heal herself. I mean, that was good timing. Her or Jam Code were my choices for who. Nope, didn't stun. And Jam Code's dead. No, that's not great. Haha! <laughs> Waste of time. Unfortunately, if we're trying to get focus on him, it's not being as low as it is. Color and didn't do much of anything, so we'll... Actually, yes, because that is piercing and flying does do more damage there. Too often to try and stun people with things or... Going off. Enough. Or it could just die. That also works. So here's hoping whatever Pina does doesn't accidentally set off whatever Moth Lady's planning. Alright. Swoop. No, then she has Rampart she can protect, but she's also the one with the least health, so that seems like a bad idea. Uh. Triple thrust, it's the one that has the higher health. Uh, slide, sure. That's not gonna work. Actually, slide isn't gonna work on any of them, so punch things. Punch them very hard. Take more than
he doesn't really have actually not go for it. Of course you go for Rapina, damn it. Okay, this ain't great. Ooh, hey, submission went up. Okay. Alright, good. Heal yourself. Good, because the enemies don't seem to seem to want to hurt or seem to be very focused on hurting you. Yeah, then why are they all attacking the mage? That sucks. Okay. This one's not gonna last long enough to do much of anything. I don't know. Earth heal on yourself. He's he's not injured. He does not need your help. Let's hold off on that attack going off. Mmm. Okay, with Ashdale's mercy too. Oh, yes, please healing. Ah! Right house still stands tall. And on a rampage, just taking everything down. Also, learn a new ability, hell yeah. I cannot afford to lose, and yet. Alright. Ooh, small chance of going to one of the ace element. No more to level that up. Actually, that would be worth leveling up, but... The reason I'm using this stack rather than the powerful one, and that's... Because hoping that would work. Oh, hey, that was a heart, actually. A heart, that wasn't too bad. Until people start... Unfortunately, it feels like one of those cascading domino effects. Oh, well, one character died. Oh, now everybody else is just dying. <laughs> Glass slippers. What are those two? Okay, so I'm curious. Is it just battles now, or... Yep, it just battles now. Alright, I'm not as interested in that. Get back to trying to capture a MOA. I just ran off in that direction now. Mm, that's too much on camera. It's gonna be one of these... Petrified Gazelle. Alright, well, I think that means there's a cock face there. I don't want to mess with that. That's here. Damn it. <laughs> Perhaps its choice of where to seek refuge is dictated by some sort of behavioral impulse. Obviously, but... Okay, let's see if we approach from this angle. Okay, so he runs in that direction. Okay. So one of these two, because... That one has a petrified gazelle. I feel like that's going to be... That means there's going to be a cockatrice there. I feel like dealing with that right now. This one. Ha <laughs> ha! Ah, got it. You won't get away this time. Alright, we've got a moa feather and a moa leg. Cool. Yeah, dude, we found moa feathers. You're an idiot. <laughs> oh, cool, we got an amulet. Chef's League. At Chef's League, we deal in food prep. Food. What do we just get an achievement for? Ironclad. 50 types of armor. Oh, nifty. At the Chef's League, we deal in food prep. Do any of you have the skills to whip up a mean meal? We pay handsomely, and brainiacs are definitely preferred in the kitchen. Knowledge is power. Oh, well, I know the perfect person to throw. Let me just double check. Yeah, he gets 16. I mean, it's four, it's base is 12 and he has 14. Either way, it's the highest intelligence we have and they're not planning to use him. So, yeah. Let Francis cook some food for you. Sure, it'll be, it'll be fine. What's this minstrel got to say? Hail, traveler. This evening I sing for you the tale of Lord Bartlett and the Raven. 
The Celestial Bartlett possesses treasure too. A helm of invisibility, silver sandals of flight. His treasures he polishes his silver sandals with beeswax. It's sent floral and bright. At world's edge, a raven proclaimed itself Lord of Earth. Lord Bartlett journeyed to its lair to face it, donning his precious treasures too. Invisible of countenance, he leapt into the air. Unseen, unseen, his visage unseen. Smell, smell, the scent of flowers. Unseen, unseen, his visage unseen. Smell, smell, the scent of flowers. The raven caught the scent and sought to consume these flowers. Unseen, Lord Bartlett cried in pain. Delicious, delicious, these legs are delicious. Give, give, give these delicious legs unto me. For three nights, Lord Bright Bartlett struck the raven until at last it plummeted into the waterfall. Yet the Lord of Earth's voice never ceased, even in defeat, repeating endlessly in ravenous call. Delicious, delicious, these legs are delicious. Give, give, give these delicious legs unto me. Thus did the celestial Bartlett lose one of his silver sandals of flight, and the raven, they say it's a plea for legs that goes from the falls even now. That's interesting. I'm not, not sure if that's useful to us, but... Let's, buddy. We found some mobile wings. Also, are you are you not dead? I hope you're not dead. Please do not. This attempt does not appear to have worked out for you either. Perhaps you would be best advised to hang up your wings and adopt a more grounded worldview, lest you come to harm. Bartlett watches over me. This I believe with every fiber of my being, and I cannot give up until I show him that I belong in the skies. I see that nothing I can I can say will dissuade you from this pursuit. Very well then, here for you. Wow, you got feathers for me. Fantastic! I can't thank you enough for this. Cool. Now if we go over there, does he successfully fly? He's still crashing. He's still crashing! You're an idiot. <laughs> Hello! Oh! Are those enemies? Hmm. Uh, let's see. Successfully protect an ally. Don't let a foe perform an interrupt. Deal damage every round. Eh, that's gonna be too hard to pull off. Oh my, he is under attack by fiends. We must help him. How's everybody doing? Okay, yep, everybody's good. I'm worried about like swapping in back up party members. Oh no, gaze and crash down. I don't like those. Uh tumble. Gaze was the worst of the two. Fortune since you can't do heaven and earth. You will start casting sleep. And then you uh if I remember correctly, skeletons are dead later. Done. Damn it! The crash under a lot of damage, but sleep is a bad thing. All right, you're plotting some epic. Ooh, effect effective against aquatic foes. Left an enemy above your head before smashing them to the ground. Okay, effective against aquatic foes. Meanwhile, I don't know what you're planning. Stop it. Okay. What are undead weak against people is fire, which we don't really have fire as an option. Remember correctly? Well, we don't, because... Oh. Someone had a fire-based ability. Oh, I don't remember. against Pierce and weak against fire. So So really you shouldn't be fighting because all of your stuff is Pierce. Nope. No. That'd be bad. Crash down. Matador, fuck you. <laughs> I shall handle this. Ole, bitch! And hopefully sleep works. Yeah, I should've figured they were immune since they were to sleep, but it was worth a shot. Alright, let's see. Let's see. 
have both on him. After the delay, it's not going to matter, but maybe we'll get a... Maybe we'll be able to get a Unite attack. I cannot allow this. Yes, ranked up. Very nice. Hopefully that means lower cost. Not the way I meant I was planning to get a Unite attack, but it worked. We shall prevail at any cost! We want to presume... Yeah, go with that. Target. Very independent of heaven and earth. Triple thrust is going to be great against heaven and dead. Heaven and earth. Actually, yeah, because that'll give... Oh, wait. Yeah, still, maybe we'll stop him from using the gaze. That would be great. Aha! Send him to heaven, crash down to earth! Stop putting Janto to sleep. Alright. Crash down and poison I don't know the right. Try to stop poison us, miss. Try to stop crash down. And um you seem closer to dying. healing. The healing's fine. Oh, it also removes status ailments. Fortunately, martial artist man is dead. That's fine. Right, that has fire. I forgot that's a thing that I have. I 
Has my skill in protecting Milady increased as well? Let's see if we can rank up Earth Heal. Yeah, it didn't work either. That's great. Alright, I forgot. Let's try and protect Nala. Thanks so much for saving me. Thankfully, my glider made it through okay. Did it? That is gratifying, but, but, but better you should be mindful of your own well-being. If we keep talking, he's just going to keep getting himself into trouble. He's an idiot. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, okay. That has a chance to teach her something new. Ooh. But the cost, and I think I want to go somewhere where I can. You or we can get lower cost for Nichiro. General with her getting lower cost on the is gonna be good. What you focus on is not something we have a lot of access to. Yeah, you okay. Hmm. That cave there is the hole of chaos. It does not say any fights, but I don't know. The cave in an RPG. Fights seem like a given. Go home, child. There's nothing here for you. Alright, fine. Clearly there's nothing there for me then. Waterfalls. Let's see what's the waterfalls first. Look, someone is standing between the waterfalls. How would you suppose he crossed over there? The Lord of Earth desires legs. Offer up your legs as tribute. What? No. No, then the Lord of Earth demands you bring some replacement legs. Then we have Moa legs. Do those count? The Lord of Earth desires legs. You lose Moa legs. The Lord of Earth desires yet more legs. Quickly now, offer up even more legs. Alright, so we went in that direction. Okay, so not the one with the deer that just died. Uh, you! Darn! Perhaps there's a choice of where to seek refuge. Yes, we know, behavioral impulse. It doesn't help us. Dude. We went over there. Where's the deer? The deer is there. Aha! I suppose we'll take the Moa feather over to the stupid try and fly boy. The Lord of Earth desires legs! <laughs> There's yet more legs still. Man, man loves his legs. He's a leg man, you know? Alright. Alright, what do we got? Gaze and he's plotting something. There we go. Plot something, get rid of that. And yes, we probably not right here. We'll just start going with uh, 20 fetters. Take you out. And yeah, it seems reasonable. Okay.
Oof, once Genzo didn't fall asleep. Boy, it seemed like he hadn't slept in a few days with how, quick, how well that worked last time. Defend Crash Down. Don't know what you're plotting. Hello, bitch. That's the only thing going off this turn. So let's get Tony Fetters going again. Focus on you still. Oh, what the hell? The door. I should have gone, but then again, if I did the counter, I wouldn't be able to interrupt. Then again, if I did the counter and it worked. Yeah, whatever. Oh, Alright, going for pulverize. Fortunately, the one that's targeting me. Fine. Take your turn last, fuck you. Um, let's see. Where are you at? There you go. Tumble! Could do Rising Nova. Yeah, Rising Nova. Feels like a waste of Jamco's turn getting Frenzy going, but one less target than the enemy or on the enemy side. Ah, oh, didn't kill it yet. Ole! Not dead yet. Alright. Tumble to try and stop that. What are you doing these days? Stand behind me, milady. At least he's not asleep anymore. We shall prevail at any cost. Whatever you're plotting, buddy, not happening. Optical flash. He was hoping. Oh, nifty. Still gets the United attack, I'll go with it. I'll give it a try. Suplex a skeleton. Not as impressive as suplexing a train, mind you, but yeah, it's still pretty cool. Fine. 
Yes. Thanks so much for saving me. Thankfully, my glider made it through okay. I wonder if I am wise to give you this, but... Whoa, you got feathers for me. Fantastic. I can't thank you enough for this. Alright. So let's see how he's doing. Probably still crashing because he's an idiot. You're an idiot. Okay, I think I figured out the pattern. Alright, no fight this time to worry about. We'll go ahead and give feathers to the... Actually, you know what? I got the pattern now. Let's catch... Let's do the MOA thing some more. Deer is there. Bird is here. Ha ha! here. Okay. Three feathers and three legs seem good. This attempt does not appear to have worked out for you either. Perhaps you would be advised to hang up your wings and adopt a more grounded world feel, lest you come to harm. Bartlett watches him over me. Yeah, whatever. Here, for you. I gave him the more feathers we had. I'm going to give him Crazy man on the waterfall, some legs. Yes, see, desires legs. It still desires legs. Okay, is your flying going any better? I flew through the air, soaring like a bird. I can never have done it without your help. Congratulations, I'm happy for you. To be able to climb so high and feel so free, I flew out over the ocean so far, and yet I returned safely. What an absolute thrill. Even more incredibly, I saw something majestic reflected upon the water that glided above it. The shadow of a crested ibis. Or it's the sac or that's the sacred bird of the celestial Bartlett, you know? I haven't the words to describe my feelings in that moment. To think that Bartlett was watching over me as I took to the air. It's overwhelming. Right then, it's time for me to get to work on refinements and upgrades. My next flight, I hope to reach Kana Island, over to the southeast. Hmm, on wings of wax. I'm guessing completing this quest. Fly in the air. We didn't fly, but he did. That's cool. Alright. Uh, is he gonna try flying again? Oh, the witch hunter. Damn it. Our paths cross again. I assume you intend to hunt witches here as well. I have heard talk that an archwitch operates here in the southeast boundary, ruling over all witches. Should I claim her head, I can put an end to the entirety of her order in a, thing, in a single fell swoop. An archwitch? Can such a being truly exist? All this talk of witch hunting and archwitches feels altogether unworldly to me. I may be, if I may be honest, however, we cannot sit idly by if indeed this state of affairs brings harm to the innocent. You must act as your conscience dictates, milady, and we shall support your every judgment. Thank you, Mundo. Alright, cool. Get some more legs. The Earth God, the Earth Lord demands legs. Here, there, bird here. There's enough legs for you yet? How many legs do you want, buddy? I know people who are really into legs and they don't want legs this much. 
Alright, so deer like, was there. Bird is here. You're there. Bird is here. So yeah, I, apparently wherever the deer is, if you draw a triangle between the three of them, the deer is the top, the bird will be at the right leg. No, you're there, so that means here. Grab one more leg just to be safe and then go see if that's enough to... If that's legs for the Earth God. I figured it'd be legs for the leg God, but I guess not. Uh, this one. Alright, there's enough legs for the leg God. Can it be the Lord of Earth is... Oh! We just do something I didn't want to do. <laughs> We're approaching world map fiend. Let's uh save. Colossal fiend appeared with a chorus or with a thunderous roar. It smashed the waterfall. The hermit appears to have been blown away by the impact. Child of man, thou hast done well to precipitate. I'm precipitating my arrival. Tell me now, what is thine desire? Treasure? Very well, prove now thy worth. Damn it, I shouldn't know this would happen. Alright. They're not tips. Or maybe tips might help, but not. Word, rewards. Skeleton, presumably the thing. And okay, this is hard. Well conditional, don't let a foe perform and interrupt. Vanquish three four foes in a single round. I don't see that last one happening. Frogs. Okay. Something played. It's fine. Just focus. Okay, well, we can put to sleep. Sleep goes off and actually work on things, even though I want to start blindly attacking things. I'm going to put our focus somewhere. The frogs count as. I mean, they're technically not reptiles, but are they aquatic? Reptiles are weak to cold. The aquatic enemy are weak to strong. We don't have much in the way of shock, so we'll try cold, see what happens. And then I guess Sonic Flash or you know, Sonic Flash. Get rid of these, because I don't think the frogs are going to be too deadly. Hot. Yes, stun went off. And you just woke up Jam Tail. Your problem. Alright.
Honestly, half the time I don't know what to do with her, so that's not actually that bad. Alright. Heal Slash about to go off. Not great. Those crash down. Also not great. Uh, tumble. See if we can at least do crash down from going off. Optical Slash. Let's line card, see if we get critical on this. No, no critical, okay. So I guess it's considered as aquatic then. Or maybe something entirely different, I don't know. Okay, so they are considered a quad. That quilt him. Stun work, yes. Alright, cool. Be on the safe side. Mm -hmm. And let's actually see, can we poison Carmilla? Place me in the floor. There. And didn't go there either. Damn it. Alright. Oh, good match use today. Good. Um Restoration. So honestly, we need to get two of them. Amphibian rain. Doesn't sound good. Share mm. <laughs> with the looking. Shit. We must be as one. Oh. Unite and attack. Assault we can't count, I'm pretty sure. I'll give it a try. Okay. Lady! Do you want to go for... Okay, good. Uh, except that that's just... Let's try to remove that. Yeah. 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 All right. Focus on bird lady. Lightning. Yes. Seems reasonable. Sure. Why not? I don't know.
really game. Oh fuck. You know what? Yeah, counter. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, the sleeping man dies, or oh hey, we got healed. So the sleeping man probably won't die then. then he gets the Nope, he still died, fuck. And your counter your counter sucks. Alright. Counter! Waste of time! I mean, it's still kind of an agility, so you got multiple things going here. Waste of time. Well, fuck. Um, uh, return to title screen. Let's return to title screen. I didn't get anything ranked up or anything like that from the fight, so retrying wouldn't even do any good. I wanted to try it again. But I'm not entirely sure I want to. Let's go see what's going on with the Arc Witch. My question why I decided that knowingly reviving an ancient... Oh, brutal. That does not sound good. How about this? Nice, easy battle now. Um... Probably going to end badly. A hole at the base of a mountain because its entrance turns. Okay, it's a, okay, no change there. Only one target, though. Defeat final foe with a united attack. Two united attacks with a single round. How? There's only. Unless there's multiple of them. That, I suppose, could be a possibility. Paralyze, poison, sleep, confuse the foe already afflicted by one of these. Hear my vow, Arc Witch! On your head lies the responsibility for all of this! Thus it is your head we of Lasha shall claim! Oh, Piffle, you young people and your witch hunts. Where do you find the energy for such nonsense? If you've so much vim, why not put it to use dealing with the chaos being of this fell pit? So I am all that remains, am I? Tell me, heretic. Which grim evil claimed your soul in exchange for this wretched power you wield? Mere destruction is too good for you! I pray you suffer! Enough! Facing her alone would be folly. Unhand me! Silence your yapping! If I cannot bring an end to a single miserable witch, then death's embrace is better than I deserve! From whence did this mad obsession of yours come? Clearly this woman will not take no for an answer, so let's fight on her behalf, hopefully keep her alive, and maybe she will us a favor. Let's see, what are we... Oh, three giant spiders. Oh, lobster spider things. I'm not sure what the hell are you. Chaos fiends. Hmm. Looks vaguely aquatic. I'm thinking aquatic. Thunder, but what else? I feel thunder on a weakness, so okay. good. Oh dear! I hope we keep the focus on one of them. Hopefully sleep goes off. Aquatic. Nope. 
Okay, not aquatic. So... Shit. Okay, cool. Oh, one being asleep isn't bad, so... Insects, maybe? Want weapons? What that is. Let's hope it can count be countered. friend to heal himself. Then again, that could actually work in our favor. We keep eating his friends and we just keep focusing on this one. So, I don't know what Thurl is, but he was hoping he can be countered. Wait, is he about to entomb the other one? I don't see what happens here. In the meantime, uh, I think I'm prep call lightning. Sure, why not? Okay, now that just hits everybody. Okay, I see. Alright. Got him on the ropes. Let's suplex this thing to death.
I don't know if my speed. There we go. Right Hell yeah! Stands tall. <laughs> Far to go. All kinds of prisma crystals. I miss. I miss those chance to blow up the A element. Well, there we go. Now that the chaos being has vanished, I am free to depart as well. Do you bear responsibility for summoning of that infernal? If so, I can offer you no quarter. Me? Certainly not. This, be this began centuries ago, long before my time. A previous arc which summoned the chaos being at the Emperor's behest, with the intent of using it to fight the Wicked One. Yet after the battle reached its culmination, the chaos being remained. Generations of arch witches have kept it sealed in the hole of chaos to prevent it from be being left to its own devices. The chaos being has disappeared, eh? You know, to these old eyes, it looked less like you defeated the thing and more like you simply... or it simply decided now was the time to return to chaos. Pray tell, what do you intend to do next? Will you continue hunting for witches? The chest is no more, swallowed by chaos. Sure, join us. Witches have stolen everything from me. Bear that in mind and remember it well. My true name is... Tsubaki. Hmm, good fortune, witch hunters. I'm guessing because she joined us? Have Camille, also known as Subaki, join your retinue. Very nice. Let's see, short sword, and triple threat. I think that yeah, that's a new formation. Eh, decent stats. Cool. All right. And let's see. New formation. Ah, Nissa and Arpina might need to swap out. All right. Triple threat. Great long and short sword text cost fewer B. Ooh, great sword, long sword, and short sword text cost fewer BP in the designated position. With a two to six BP, BP increases the rate of once per turn. Use all three types of swords to subjugate your foe. Actually, that sounds pretty useful. All right, so we are going to swap you out for Agniana. And as for Athena, don't black robe figure. What's Tsubaki got going on? Uh, where are you? We just recruited her. What's she got going on? Uh, okay. Oh, okay. So she's a short sword user. Hmm. And she got oh, golden note. That's right. The thing that she kept using against us when we had the baby. Then she was trying to kill us because the baby for some reason. No, that totally went nowhere, so that's great. Uh, golden note, that she might actually be useful. You know what? Yeah, Tsubaki. Let's uh, give you a bit of time in the limelight. Oh, your weapon is... No, no, yeah, there we go. Grand Silver Fioret. Remove it from Nessa. Power shield. Uh, yeah, take that from Nessa as well. Ring mail. No, wait. Oh, there we go. Steel armor. Take that from Nessa. Leather boots. Sabaton. Oh, that's slippers. Hmm. Okay, I thought those were accessories for some reason. Niana. No one else uses that, so don't need to worry about that. Find soldier suit. You're good there. Open helm. Actually, you're good there, too. Alright, cool. Tsubaki is a bit behind on the level. Uh, I'll converse. I'm sure you can fly, so let's fly together. Shall we save the world together? Yeah, let's go, sure. The skies are clear, and the wind's at our backs. Of course he'd be named Orville. 
Of course, now it's making like, wait, it was Orville and something or other. What were the two, what were the names of the Wright brothers? <laughs> Orville and Wilbur. That was it. Black Belt. I'm guessing... Oh, he's another martial artist. So I'm guessing that's probably buff to martial artist with that one. So is he a better martial artist than our lighthouse guard? No, so that's uh, formation. Martial arts cost you or BP for the ally in the designated position. It's actually... There it is. Triple threat. Yeah, two to six, though. But, with this party, we actually have three chairs. Oh, wait, no. And if we bring Urpina back, yes. But I think someone will keep with the Royal Hearts. Alright. Orville. Oh, you have Thunder Kick. That's a new one. What's that do? Mark Uh, let's see. Thrust your leg forward with shocking force, delaying the target. Electric striking and delay. This is fact in my experience, and from some things I've read, apparently martial arts are slow to rank up, so... Oh, and he can learn thunder. Then again, since martial arts, like the other things, there's limits, it seems like, with certain weapons you need, or only certain weapons can learn certain things, so... Mm. I don't know. Also, what I'm thinking about doing here, I'm probably going to change this out. Uh, Ignis only, there we go. Here. This is actually an easy battle. Uh, weirdly, the brutal fight was easier than this hard fight, go figure. But easy. Vanquish three foes in a single round. Don't let any allies get knocked out. Cloak condition with a ranged attack. Cool. Okay. Actually, do I have anybody that has a ranged attack? Actually, right, nope. Quick question. Um, yes, okay. This is a good, this is a good layout with this right now. <laughs> Well, they sort of like their conditionals, that's for sure. Uh... I didn't really think about that with the range attack thing, oh well. Sorry about trying to put everybody to sleep. And... Start ranking you up, baby. I'm sure this will not be a mistake. <laughs> well, at least it didn't backfire on me. That's good. Stampede. Not great. Uh, let's see. Actually, with Tree Cleaver, I actually just have to do Tree Cleaver every time. It's probably a good plan, because it'll do more damage. Presume. Uh, plan, 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 plan. Let's see, resistance to shock, yeah, weak to fire. I don't really have anything that does fire, so that doesn't help us. Oh, yeah, that's right, it was the mace girl. She's the one who had the ability to do fire. Well, that and her and her peanut, apparently. I forgot about that one. Um. Sure, see that goes off. Yeah, you can't put plants in the way of your Pollen. Hmm. Yeah, two different characters using pollen. Um, that would be more beneficial. We'll put the focus and the pressure on him. Ah. The first stone 
is mine to catch! Like a flower in bloom! in one turn, but good enough. Things are coming along real nice. Oh yeah, she's a bit behind the level curve there, I'm thinking. Will this help me hunt witches? Stop it! <laughs> Commandant roll. Max BP up. Attack power down. Hmm. Paralysis, poison, stun resistance up. <laughs> poison resistance up. Wow, oh, she's got a lot of different rolls she can take on. Ah, okay. All right, so small chance to glimmer an Ignis Element spell. Damn it! An elephant bird egg. Okay. I may have to do something over to take us over there. I guess not. The blue hole there. We can try and get treasure. Alright. Hmm. That's world map. Wait. Did we go over to new areas this way? Apparently not. Looks like we could. Over to here. I used to specialize in Nextura. Have you heard? A man found an impossibly large footprint to the south. He only glanced at it from afar, but still swore as it to its side. Hmm, that is intriguing. What shall we do, lady? I suppose we should investigate. Alright. I believe... Well, not you, but the equipment to pull you from. Especially the nature of crystals. That in a moment. You specialize in a draw. You specialize in a draw. 
specialize in water. You specialize in maze. Leave this. Leave it. Oh, big footprint. Fie, that is no footprint. A horde of fiends, and so many, whatever shall we do? Take them out. That's what we do to fiends. Uh, okay, yeah, easy, easy, and normal. Cool. Start chopping up plants. All right. You just die, but the sun didn't go off, but you just also just die, that works too. Like a flower in bloom! 
mostly on skills we don't normally have because we got very low cost and it's gonna end whatever happens. Righteousness! Righteous! Ness, fine. But I, I'd say righteous as well. It's pretty righteous. This dude. is vital to a wall such as myself. I yet have far to go. Now, what are the other rewards I forget? Uh, increase defense two times. Yeah, okay. When I get one of those at least, so yeah. Probably, probably, probably striking. Yep, blunt damage. All right. This will be over in a moment. A defensive technique, perhaps. Ooh. Oh, yes, please. What is down this way? Raise your greatsword high in the air, bring it to bear on your target. Alright. So just raw smash it. You smash that. Smashing. Smashing everything. Same animation, interesting. Will this conflict never end? No, it won't. Stop worrying about it. And what is this? Eh, bugs and something abnormal or abnormal. It looks like a bug. I think it might be a bug. I do. Bugs and plants. And plants and bugs. Alright, let's see. Probably plants are gonna be the deadlier thing, so focus on that. is an honor. My apologies. Fuck. Hmm. Hidden attack. I don't think I want anything to do with that, but I'm not going to be able to stop it. Cool. 
Alright, screw you. <laughs> that looks very awkward when it doesn't land. <laughs> All right. Yes. I didn't kill it? What? Huh. Alright then. Accomplished nothing. We finally defeated them all. There were so many. I was most surprised to learn that the giant footprint was actually just a horde of fiends. It must have been coincidence that took, they took that shape. It is not a phenomenon one sees often. Yet how many times can such a coincidence occur? Either way, we've confirmed the rumor's validity. Let us leave it there. I find this all terribly unsatisfying. Oh hey, someone's bad for me. Okay. That job was dealt with in squares, though, man. Give me some real work. Bigness invitation skills increase. 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 Hmm. Bigness crystals. Dash. Cool. Alright. I feel like probably the whole thing with the rumors here is probably a big quest or something, but I don't feel like dealing with it. Provincial boundary. Go to Ronicum. Alright. Still working on it. Um, go here. I've explored most of the eastern half of the continent. I feel like going west seems you know, like it'd be fun. And there's our clone again. <laughs> and she just left. Of course. We, re we ready the feast for a hundred folks just like you asked. Pray, forgive me citizen, but you say you ready to feast for a hundred people? Took all the ingredients in our village, so it did, but since your highness was so insistent, we were happy to do it. You're, that's what you're gonna do. But what are you gonna do with all this here food exactly? Um, I. Core, cool, but look at me running my mouth. I, I didn't mean no disrespect, your highness. It's an honor to serve you, so it is. Thank you. Feast for a hundred. What do we do with this? What can all this mean, Mondo? As you did not ask for this food, it's clear that someone else did. There's no doubt in my mind that your double is, a hungry, is the hungry culprit. If that isn't made, what do we do now? We cannot simply throw this food away. The villager would likely riot. It. Would likely riot. What do we do with a hundred with food to feed a hundred people? Back right to the capital, I don't know. Is something wrong, Rapina? I have something to tell you, stepmother. I see. It's said that everyone in the world has a person or three who looks like them, but this seems to be something far different. I intend to pursue other or pursue our suspect further, 
But for the moment, I have no idea what to do with all this extra food. Why not treat the or trade it to the? Ah, there we go. Yeah, treat them in at Fort Catherine. That's a good plan. It would surely raise their morale. And since the food was made in lug, we don't need to worry about poison. A fine idea. I will look into it. Heck yeah, it's a great idea actually. All is well. Please accept this gift. Hand over the feast for a hundred. But my lady, you are so, you are far too kind. Thank you so so much. Pray continue your good work. Aye, milady, we'll lay down our very lives. Cool. Mm. Product development. Can we do anything interesting with the laborers? We cannot. At least not here. Alrighty. Actually. Question. Alright, let's go. What I want to take a look at is... Oh! There's something here. Okay, there's that too. What I was wanting to do is... Is it here where we found the barrel of stuff? Cinematic beach. Uh, I thought I listened to a minstrel. Was it here, maybe? Product development here, let's see what's going down with that. No, that didn't help. Alright. So yeah, I remember I was, I was thinking maybe we can find some more hay over here. And then we have to to plant this thing to do a lot of other stuff, so that's not. Uh where is that? Hey. Northeast boundary. Okay, so we have to travel quite a ways for that. We got a lot of that stuff. Mm -hmm. Ibex ring, there we go. Where's the Ibex ring? Spring cave, alright. Seems to have fell into this cave west of here. Two normal battles. <sighs> With wait, Aeus. Right, I mean, we can do this before the fight, too, but, you know, if I'm thinking about it now, we're gonna do it. Uh, no, only. Aeus only, there we go. A very weak weapon, unfortunately. Maybe we're looking at the triangle level it up, I guess. Deal damage every round. Don't let foes perform even a single united attack. Fight with different foes, and I don't know the different formations thing. Is there a Scarlet Shard here? Oh, there's monsters, that's for sure. Let's see, so they're all undead. A oh, great dance. I hate dance. Dance is a monstrous ability. Okay, they're weak to pretty much all the stuff, so we'll start with Call Lightning. Start prepping that, and they're weak to fire, which doesn't really help us much. Any ability we have, so. Uh -huh. Alright, well he's frenzied now, that's cool. Ah, he's about to do crash down, huh? Oh, optical slash it is. Optic slash. Blast. Whatever.
Here it comes! Hell yeah. yeah of course. Stylish when that goes off and kills him. <laughs> okay, confusion. That's not great. Thankfully, it won't really be a problem for the next turn. And we should be able to kill this thing less quickly. Will I truly be a help? <laughs> Preparation is key in all things. Hmm. I'm not sure what that thing is, but... Alright, let's do this. Oh, bird, okay. Ooh, Tumble is now ranked two. Does that mean higher success rate, I hope? I mean, it's already at one BP, so it's not like it can be lower cost. Sweet. Okay, what are the enemies doing? Slash, full slash. Hit the bird. Hopefully, this doesn't go horribly awry. It went horribly awry. Oh, 
Alright, paralyzed it. Nice. I learned piercing is what triggers that, so you know what? Screw you, suplex. Crystals and obsidian, we're good. It wasn't here, perhaps we missed it. Someone might have made off with it before we arrived. Let us gather information in the nearby town. Hey, right, who's that? Griffin! Training is its own reward, ha! Oh, sword skill, short sword skill level increased by three. He doesn't use short swords though, weird. 60 prisma crystals, hell yeah. Cool, alright. This. Do you know anything about a Scarlet Shard? Long ago, a shard was found in the was found in a spring cave west of here. The night it was taken, or the night it was taken into a cast or the castle, a great fire broke out, burned the entire state to the ground. Let's make for this castle. And while we're here, now what this what this dude get to say? Gather round, and I shall spin a tale of Shams, celestial of law, long ago, before the firebringer was cast out. Shams made a labyrinth and rivalry with Imhokal, celestial of architecture. The labyrinth was complicated, and there was but a single path through, which or which very much reflected the spirit of Shams. He boasted greatly of his work and invited the other celestials to come and see. But the Firebringer was not impressed and went about smashing every wall he came to. Then, with his silver sandals on his feet, he took to the sky and made his good escape. Or made good his escape. The labyrinth and chaos, the remaining celestials became lost inside, but Demazu, the seafaring celestial, used her compass to guide them out after seven days and nights. As the celestials expressed their relief at escaping, Shams raised his voice in alarm. Gone, he cried. Gone, gone, my shadow is gone. So heartbroken was he over the destruction of his masterpiece that Shams forgot his shadow in the labyrinth, yet no one, not even Shams himself, dared to re-enter that accursed place. Thus did the shadow of, shadow of Shams come to wander to and fro over the earth. Some say it grew to be the king of the labyrinth, while others claim it managed to escape entirely. Hmm. So that something tells me go explore the labyrinth, find shadow, get killed. Alright, so I'm guessing the castle, not the estate, but we're looking for. Let's see. Easy and then normal. I'll get knocked out, perform two united attack in a single round, don't let a form perform an interrupt. Okay. I wonder if the Scarlet Shard is here. Alright, you're going all defensive. That's great. Well, but we'll just call lightning. And hope this isn't a terrible idea. I hope it wasn't, okay. Ah, the counter! Fuck. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Useful, ain't I? The thoughts. 
fuck are you? I'm guessing aquatic. Plant, plant. All right. Sweet friend. Don't like the sound of that. Crap, wait, no, that doesn't work. <laughs> okay, you want to doing a thing I didn't want you to do? And... Call down the lightning, baby. Oh, so much for that. All lightning. Okay, he's gonna start casting that. Meanwhile, I'm gonna do this. Oh, I guess not aquatic then. Just slap him away. Fine. Not aquatic. You know, it looks like a weird, like a seahorse and a dragon had a weird baby. I don't know what to make of that, but it's not aquatic. Okay. Mm, reptile? Unfortunately, since we don't have anything that hits cold, even if I'm right on that, we can't test it or do anything about it. Fine, if you want me to hit you, I'll chop you up. Okay. What the shit just happened?
Huzzah! The sound body is a must for a lighthouse keeper. Yes, don't actually work for it. Casting. Let's see. He's setting up call lighting. Never mind if you guys still have the tactical. <laughs> Sound body is a must for a Very night. good. I shall continue the fight. Aren't you sexy? Actually, you kind of are. The whole red hair and the peekaboo haircut. Hell yeah. Alright. Come on! Go for it! Learn, 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 learn. Damn it. We did not find the shard. Perhaps we missed it. Someone might have made off with it first. We need information. Let us search the area. Cool. But what? There's quite a commotion coming from the water mill. It looks most shady, milady. Eh, he rhymed. I feel like I'm about to go down. Uh, Clamorous voice can be heard inside the water mill. Perhaps people or people appear to be using it as a gambling hall at the moment. Do you know anything about a scarlet shard? <laughs> if you want information, you're gonna have to wager something petty. What chick? What chick to challenge Mondo the Storm to a bet? Ten imperial gold, it is. Are you sure, Mondo? Ha! We ride. 
15. Lost. Fine. Then I had someone took that shard to the haunted estate yonder. Mondo, you really need to tell me what you got up to in your youth. Actually, Nate, there are some things I should not know. I appreciate it, milady. Even I have many things I cannot speak of, especially to you. Enough. Let us go examine the house of spooks. Or this house of spooks. Dibiv words. There we go. There's armaments. Grand Enchanter's Spire. Herbal Worms. Goblin Warrior. Low Conditional. Fight with only female allies in all battles. Fight with different allies in all battles. Uh, can we pull off? We just need to swap out our martial artist and our tank. This is looking good. Beatrice in a while, but she, she can be good. Where did I put her? There's our piano. specialize in AS. Holy butts you do! We're gonna look for product development here. Uh, yes, okay. Nothing to do there. Bludgeon. Hell yeah. Nine, it's a good number. Of course, we're playing the wrong game series for that. Actually, like, uh, the nine might be not be a great number in this series. Unlimited Saga, which actually, to my understanding, once you understand it, is actually a really good game. But good luck understanding it. Like for a series that's known for being kind of weird and obtuse at times, it is like the most weird and obtuse of the series. So yeah, there's that. Sabaki has more power. So, swap you out. There we go. Alright, cool. Do you truly think this place is haunted? Haunted is a term given to places to keep people from getting too close. I think there's likely something of keen interest to you. How much undead? No plants. Alright, well, let's start off. Lightning, Tree Cleaver, maybe that'll line up a United attack, let me hope. Oh fuck, okay, so, you can interrupt extraction, cool. Fine. That 
Like, I mean, not fine, but we'll live. Um, let's see. No, we don't have any... No, we do have, uh, that, but that is very costly. You do not like people using, uh... There is... There is some place. Ah, it's right, in Kindle. Since it's thrust, hopefully that's the only slash that that dude can interrupt. Nope, he just he interrupts everything. Oh, it's also different. Okay. So wait, so thrust he can do friendly to soul, which is hip. So actually, if he interrupts slash, that's better anyway. Hmm. Not a great start. Definitely not a great start. Also didn't help to appreciate it that way. Alright. Um, yeah, not doing great. Hell yeah! Just cook everything! With electricity! The induction stoves are awesome. I shall end all witches! Why don't you look pretty in your full plate mail armor? Cute. I guess what you were going for with that pose, I don't know. Oh wait, only male allies? Oh. <laughs> I misread that completely. Oops. <laughs> That's not great. That could have killed him. The first stone is mine to cast. Blast it off! Oh, 
Okay, we're not expecting that outcome. <laughs> like a flower in bloom! Oh, and the multi-target, okay. That's why we're only getting the mage there, okay. Attacks, he's almost dead. Come on, one of these should kill him. There we go. I yet have far to go. Doubt there are human beings living in a mansion filled with fiends. Was that a real ghost? Pray tell me it wasn't, and we didn't even find the shard after all that. Hmm. Dog is here. Oh, what an adorable dog! A public graveyard used by a nearby town. The dog that emerged from the haunted estate lingers in front of one of the graves. Uh, save game. Something tells me something's about to. It doesn't say battle, but something tells me it's about things about to go down. I wonder if the ghost has a grave. Fine, Mondo. Grave robbing is the worst of crimes. The dog has something in its mouth. Ah, there it is. Crimson shard. Quite, or scarlet shard, whatever. What does this mean? My lady, look, the dog is gone. A ghost dog? Perhaps this was a reward for purifying the mansion and grave of fiends. I accept this graciously. May you find peace. Now destroy the shard. Let it begin. Crystals, Ignis Crystals. Oh, cool. Alright. Coming over here didn't really accomplish much of anything. But if I'm not mistaken from my understanding of how things play out, there are still some more Scarlet Shards that we can find. 
Let's go to Gradient. But with five of them, I think we can advance the story. I'm not sure there's much reason to try to develop anything we can do here. Well, a number of different ways to acquire laborers. Well, that's it. We can't even get into any of the ways to acquire laborers. Also, I wanted to go to Asukan. <laughs> I wonder if we might cross to Asukan from here. I just keep searching for and just... I must go to Asukan. If we must, your cooperation has been invaluable. I suppose I've more or less finished what I set out to do. Shall we go then? We are sure to find a Scarlet Shard in Asukan as well. Alright, well let's go to Asukan. Is there even a Scarlet Shard in Asukan, Sasha? There is indeed. However, we do not need to search for it as we have done this as we have done thus far. And why is that? In that case, we should prioritize the rescue of your Lord Father immediately. Aye, that would be good. Make it so. Very well, I can only pray the Holy Republic turns my father over without a deal of fuss, but I wager will not be so fortunate. Sensibly to prove himself. Allow citizens to spit take these matches, brighten the masses with the means of blowing off steam. Estel Temple. North Market. Mokai Temple. Holy Republic Soldiers. Social Pride of the Military Arts. I have no idea. Okay, let's talk to the soldiers. They kind of stand out. What do they have to say? I am Urpina Julianus. I have quelled the Earth Serpent's fury and thus accomplished my mission. So I would have you return my father at once. You have done well in accomplishing your task. Set to you or set to you by the gods, Urpina Julianus. Does this mean you will be returning my father to me? Most assuredly, but be not lax in your duty to the gods moving forward, for the error made by the house by House Julianus was to serve the Empire and Emperor instead of the Celestials. I shall commit your words to my heart. You have my thanks, sir. Opina! Father! My lord. You have done it admirably, my dear child. You honor both our name and your humble father. Father! Father! What is it, Opina? Tell me. My lady has toiled a great deal in her duties as acting, or as acting head of House Julianus, my lord. Now she has finally returned to being but herself. I am sorry to have put you to so much trouble. We have we have lost Lord Antonius. Antonius has died. Uh, Rapina, I have caused you such pain. Father, oh, father. Let us return to Silmium. Hold a moment yet. We've we've yet one or we've yet one critical task remaining. Fie! You nearly forget about. I nearly forgot about the Scarlet Shard. Where should we go? You claimed to know where it was located, did you not? Yes, it is here, on your hand. You cannot me mean to say that the ring I carry is a moment as a memento of my father, the Scarlet Shard. I mean just that, and thus it must be destroyed. It cannot be. This is a noble ring of reputable origins, crafted from the jewel of the finest quality and bestowed upon us by the Emperor himself. It cannot be a shard of the Firebringer. Blame not yourself. Prior to the Wicked One's exile at the hands of the Celestials, he scattered pieces of himself in secret. Now hand over the ring. Father, say something, I pray. Tell her we will not part with it. Hand over the ring. Even, your, even you, Father. I cannot... Oh, Mother. Mother. We shall destroy it without delay. Let it begin. summoning. Good 
25 Under Crystals, 20 Natura, 20 Ignis. My journey is at an end for now. Thank you, Arpina. I bid you farewell. What? <laughs> Sasha? That woman was an avatar of a spiritual. You mu yours must have been a journey fraught with great trials, Arpina. It was, Father. Now let us return to Silmium. And Mondo, thank you for everything. Once again, I owe a great debt to everyone, and I thank you all deeply. I pray that you will continue to look most favorably upon House Julianus moving forward. Cool! Some twenty days after returning from az Khan. Okay, I guess I have to hit button on auto. It's not auto. Advance. I cannot remain in Silmium like this no longer, Mondo. I wish to leave Ronicum and travel. You must help convince Father to let me go. Indeed, there are yet many strange things afoot, including the Earth Serpent and the Scarlet Shards. Yes, and I wish to seek out such things and deal with them proactively, for the sake of House Julianus, nay, for something even more. It would be an honor if the Celestials chose you to do as much, but as your guardian I am hesitant to let to see you shoulder such monumental tasks, my lady. Your concern is appreciated, Mondo, but we must do all that we can in these dark times. After all, do the Celestials not aid those who first help themselves? I will not allow you to act more recklessly than you already have. Only by the providence of the Celestials have you survived thus far, and you cannot rely on such grace forever. Stand down, Mondo. Now is not now is the time to listen. What would become of House Julian if I lost you, Urpina? I have already had your mother and brother taken from me, and to lose you as well would be it would be I'm sorry, father. I'm so sorry that I couldn't save Antonius. Your pain is my own, so save your tears. Go then. If this is if this be a trial given to us by the Celestials, I must let you suffer it. Father Go and complete your trials with honor. Mondo, guardian, or Mondo, guard my daughter with your very life. I know not what manner of trials the Celestials will bestow upon her, but spare no effort to ensure that she conquers them. I shall do this and more, my liege. Do what you must, Urpina, then return to me in safety. Yes, father. Mondo, we are off. You may, mo you may move about as you please, my lady. The Celestials will guide your steps. All right. Anyway, from my understanding, this is kind of like... Oh. Mm, stupid bots. Anyway, uh, as I was saying, this is uh, a lot like where we left off with uh, after finishing kind of uh, Rapina's per or personal story quest. We kind of... There are a couple of options we can do, and then completing that apparently gets us to the end of the game somehow. I'm not sure how it works fully, uh, but yeah. Considering it's almost... Oh, it's been over two and a half hours. Wow. All right, then. This seems like a good uh, stopping point. Did I already save? I think I already saved. I wasn't going to save again. Just going to save site. Anyway. Considering this seems like a pretty good stopping point, I think we'll call it a day. Tune in. Tune in uh, tomorrow. Normal 6 p.m. Uh, mountain time. Or Sunday 6 p.m. mountain time. Or whatever. For people who aren't watching live. I don't know if there are any of those who are. Anyway, tune in then. Uh, we'll be picking up with some more Cthulhu Saves Christmas. Because what's better than an Eldritch Horror saving Christmas? I have weird taste in games. I'm starting to realize. Anyway, until next time, as always, later, folks.